Welcome, everybody. Good afternoon, Dean Dattar, Robert Ryan, distinguished guests, family, and friends, and of course, the class of 2022. My name is April Weathers, and I am... And I am a proud member of Section H and the African American Student Union. And I am the Harvard Business School Student Association's Chief Community Officer for the class of 2022. Now, before we begin today's proceedings, we want to make a few acknowledgments. First, we acknowledge that Harvard University is situated upon the traditional land of the Massachusetts tribal nations. We acknowledge the painful history of genocide and forced removal from this territory, and we honor and respect the many diverse indigenous peoples still connected to this land. May we work together to restore this land. Second, between 1636 and 1783, more than 70 individuals were enslaved by Harvard leaders, faculty, and staff. May we honor their memory and the memory of all the enslaved women, men, and children whose labor generated wealth that helped create the Harvard we know today. To those unfamiliar, acknowledgments like these are intended to stand alongside our celebrations this week and to recognize ongoing efforts by the university and its affiliates to consider their history and the present day implications of that history. To our guests, we thank you for joining the class of 2022 as the first class to see some of those efforts come to fruition. I do wanna pause here for a moment to depart from what were my prepared remarks to acknowledge the current tragedy of the 21 senselessly lost lives from the shooting at Robb Elementary in Uvalde, Texas. There's much, much more to say here, but you'll hear several calls to action in the remarks made today that remind you, collectively, small efforts can have big impacts. And I hope we all heed this advice as we look to our future. It is with that, that I want to express my deep gratitude to you all for joining us as we conclude our time here at Harvard Business School. Tomorrow, we will join all of Harvard University for commencement, but today is just for us. I will risk sounding a little cliche or a little chuggy by acknowledging that our class came in at an unprecedented time. We will leave here changed and go off into a changed world. In both good ways and bad, our experience at Harvard Business School was unlike any other classes. We all chose, here, chose to come here knowing that that was a possibility, and still we came. The remarkable thing is that we still had our share of dreaded cold calls, uh, recurring recruiting nightmares, any case preppers out there? <laughs> Uh, and vulnerable moments. I'd like to think that it was classes like ours that the class of 1996 was thinking about when they dreamed up class day. So 26 years after its inception, and the first year back in person, let's remember the original intent of class day and allow ourselves time to formally reflect on everything that this Harvard Business School experience turned out to be. Yeah. 